Hey y'all, welcome to the channel. So this morning we're making breakfast. We're having little mini pumpkin shaped pancakes and these vegan egg bites. And then we're going to do some light shopping. I like to sit and relax and enjoy breakfast. If you have my book, Leveling Up to Your Best Life, then you probably read the part where it's important to set your table and sit down and enjoy your meal. Now I'm going to take a little bit of time to read and, you know, just relax in my parlor. It's a beautiful day and I like to spend time in my home, of course, because that's where I spend most of my time. <laughs> I really like coloring and adult coloring books and I got these markers. There are so many of these markers and a few coloring books from Amazon. If you are like me and you like to color, then I will have some of these coloring books linked in the description below um, with the Amazon links as well as the markers if you are interested in any of these products that you see in the video. But for now, I'm just showing you how I like to relax and you know feel a little bit creative this coloring book is kind of more of an autumn coloring book it's called what is it called <laughs> cozy autumn and just all the pictures of the fall and pumpkins and things like that and i have this huge marker set from amazon and you know there's so many colors in here it makes it a lot easier to be more creative when coloring I also bought a few of these coloring books for my daughters because they also like to color sometimes, but they haven't used them yet. So they're there if they ever want them. And here's one I colored. It was like a creature's um, a coloring book and they're so cute. I think it's Creatures Cottage Core. I'm not sure. I'll definitely have the link in the description if you like these types of coloring books. But yes, coloring is so relaxing and just a way to spend time with your kids or just spend time alone and just doing something creative yes i'm starting to read this book i think i'm already on chapter nine it's so funny and gory it's a page turner for sure so i'll have that linked as well below and here i'm enjoying a cup of a uh, cocoa and a pumpkin muffin while i read Hey y'all, so uh, today I have on my pumpkin spice latte earrings and there's a little pumpkin and leaf and then I have on my pumpkin spice latte shirt. It's um, getting into fall mood and I also have some stickers that I got on Amazon. They give you like this huge pack of sticker sheets. They're all the same sheet. And I bought the whole pack. I don't know how many are in here, but it's a lot. It's kind of thick. And I like to decorate my envelopes when I do my Patreon mail outs. So if you are part of the Patreon monthly uh, mail out, you will probably see some of those type of fall stickers on your envelope this month and next month probably. So um, yeah, thank you. 
thank you to all the Patreon. Shout out to the Patreon members. I appreciate y'all supporting the Patreon and the channel. So if you are wanting to join the Patreon, definitely check out the links in the description bar and those links will take you to the Patreon. I have two different Patreons, one for each channel. So make sure that uh, if you want to join the Shira 7, then make sure that's the one that you're clicking on. I'm probably only gonna have that one if this is the video for that channel. So if it's for the other channel, then um, it's definitely gonna be the other Patreon. If you're interested in both, then definitely check out both channels and you'll probably have the links to each Patreon. I'm coloring in my little creatures coloring book. I hope that you enjoy coloring as much as I do. I'm just going to sit here and take my time but first lunch i got this vegan pizza from mod pizza it is so good and it tastes just like real pizza so that's what i'm eating for lunch of course i had to share so now i'm just finishing up this little cute creatures cottage core creatures a coloring page from the coloring book and if you like stuff like this remember it's linked below in the description bar with the amazon link so yeah isn't this cute all my markers and yeah this cloud was glowing so beautifully i just had to get it on film and then the next morning velvet was ready for breakfast she does not eat at the table <laughs> after breakfast we headed to the school to drop off my daughters it's always a beautiful drive in the morning because you can see the sun and it's like getting a little bit cooler since we're closer to autumn and I do this every morning. So yes, I got my pumpkin spice latte being so basic. now of course it's time to go shopping so i went to the mall at first i hit up burlington's because they have the good candles for super cheap and they have so many beautiful decorations for your home i love to go to burlington when i'm looking for candles decor and just maybe you know a little bit of um tops or you know, jeans or something that they may have they have some cute stuff as well so yep burlington it's open super early so as soon as i drop the kids off i literally can go get a coffee and then go to burlington because it's open like at eight o'clock for us early shoppers then of course i headed to Saks fifth off i didn't really end up getting anything in here i just looked around i like to park near this store because it's close to the other stores that i like to go to so um, you'll see but i do look around a little bit here and their shoe section wasn't very good, so I didn't have time. They rearranged a little bit, and it looks like they're downsizing for some reason. Maybe they're getting ready for the holiday um, ad additions. I don't know. Maybe they're having extra things sent in for the holiday, so they're trying to make room because it was a little bit empty when I went in there. So I really didn't see anything. They had some skincare, some accessories, and things like that. But I really just walk through here and park here so that I can get to But these Tory Burch purses were really cute. And I really like this tote, but I, I have some things over like that already. So, so I needed some, you know, clothes because I always like to get a few things for the changing season. I went to J. Crew, looked around, they had some really cute stuff. And I ended up getting a top and a pair of jeans and some earrings, and I'll show you those later on in the haul. Then, of course, I headed over to the Ralph Lauren Polo store and looked around a bit. They had some really nice items that I liked. Um, um, these boots are going to be on my wish list. And um, I'm getting, a, you know, a few items for fall. Uh, I, what I ended up getting here was like a sweater vest, um, some jeans, a shirt, um... If I don't remember what else I got, I think that was it. 
uh, a few other things probably. Y'all, I spent a lot of time in this store going through everything. They have um, kids section, they have women's, and they have men's, and big and tall. They have like all these different sections, so I went through a lot of the sections. And let me tell you, ladies, on the Level Up channel, yes, if you are looking for big, tall men, or, you know, ex-athletes, former athletes, athletes, most of them may be shopping in stores like this because they have a big tall section and some of the items are, you know, nice. So I saw um, a couple in here um, when I shopped in here before and I always see, you know, um, different types of people in here that look like they, you know, they got some money. So a um, little tip, Ralph Lauren, sprinkle, sprinkle. <clears throat> anyway, had to check out. After that, I also went to Banana Republic, but I had left my phone in the polo store, so I can only show you the haul. So I ended up getting these two pair of slacks at Banana Republic. They are comfy, stretchy, cute, and very versatile. Um, and this is what I ended up getting at the polo store. I got this really cute sweater vest. I got a pair of bootcut jeans. I got a um, Oxford shirt. And I got, a, yeah, it's like a blue, light blue and white stripey shirt. I also got a pair of, uh, I don't even know, like the cinched waist jeans at all. Okay, and then from J. Crew, I bought this really cute top with this um, pattern. It's a, it reminds me of the old polo um, pattern that they used to have. It's like the um, plaid. I also got those earrings. I got some leggings and I got another pair of jeans um, from J. Crew. I like the way their jeans fit and Polo and J. Crew, they have the high waist. It's kind of stretchy and fits great. From Burlington, I got this cute sweater. I also got Layla, a sweatshirt. And then I got this other blue sweater. It's kind of cute for fall. Um, got a bunch of candles, some socks, and I actually have more that I'll probably show you in a different haul from Burlington. I left the bag in my car, so. You'll get to see that on maybe a different vlog. I got this pumpkin spice soap. I'm just relaxing with a cup of cocoa. I'm going to light my pumpkin spice candle that I got at Burlington and read some more of my book and just relax. I'm also going to be playing some little ambiance in the background. It was like an autumn ambiance I found on YouTube. So this is how I relax in the evenings. I read, light a candle and just relax. Anyway, thank you guys so much for joining. And if you are a member, thank you guys for being a member. If you are new, please subscribe and hit the notification so that you can get notified when I put out videos or go live. I'll see y'all on the next one. Thanks so much. Sprinkle, sprinkle. Bye, y'all.